I, I think it's important for the leadoff on this hole, Karen, to get the ball in the short grass and maybe three woods the play, but oh, this is a nice one. This is that draw you were talking about. That's going to be perfect. Yeah, the thing is, you got to get in the fairway. It's a long shot. The whole location's back today. It's always a tough hole. Four is a good score here on this hole nearly every day. Baylot here at the uh, tenth. Second shot here. The tenth also can be quite tricky. Hole location is tucked on that very right side of the green today, Jim. Yeah, it's tough to get it all the way back here. She does a nice job. That's a tricky read, but two good shots in there. Beautiful chance for birdie. That's the key here because otherwise the pressure is on your. This is a hard hole, and four is going to be fine. That's exactly what she had yeah. to do right there. Yeah. Really slow putt. Really good putt. Nice. Nice birdie here at 14. That has quite a bit of movement on it, Jim. I There's mean, a bunch of movement on this green. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> 212, really, ball sitting down a little bit. I, the only way to get this ball on the green is get it tumbling with this club. Little punch shot with this club trip. Well, that's uh, exactly what it's doing, Karen. Might need to sit down a little bit. Boy, that is one good golf that's shot right excellent. there. Excellent. That's going to be a fast putt down the slope, but nonetheless, that's a great shot. It's a shot. putt, Jim. Exactly. That's the important thing. Exactly. With your partner in trouble. That's a wonderful shot in here. Shouldn't be a lot in this putt. They're only one under par for the rounds. Yeah, get some one there. Yeah, you got to get going. Yeah. Uh, this is a good line. So she took it up nice and high. That is a great line. They actually held just below the hole. Good place to have it. Nice shot. Carrying in the carrying in the last couple of years has improved. When she first got on tour, always was a good short game, but she's really improved. That got a little stronger. Uh, I think one of the interesting things that we heard her say too was that it's quite warm out here today, so yes. she felt like the ball was going to fly further. Exactly. All right, Mac now all the way down on the bottom here at the ninth. Perfect spot. Her partner is in the creek, so fortunately she had a good opportunity there with the wedge. That's a good thing about having a partner. I know that. I played golf with you yesterday. You're a great partner. Here at 12, drivable today, 247. Easiest hole. Some players drivers too much. Well, it's only 237 to the front. 217 hey. carries the cross bunkers. And that carries everything nice. <laughs> I would imagine that, I mean, we might see a, some three woods on there. Par, so her partner, Emma, can really, really go for that birdie. Interesting play with the putter here. I agree. It's so all personal. It, yeah, it gets kind of fast right there, so. Oh. So well, much more interesting. Yeah. <laughs> I guess Why she knew she what she was doing. <laughs> exactly. Never second guess the player. <laughs> great, great there. They're typically always going to choose the club that they're most comfortable with in that situation. And safe, yep. Uh, what's the green slopes away from her? This is just the old super Flopidopolis. Hmm, pretty good. That's really good. Awesome. Oh, I jumped the gun on it. That was almost an all well four. That was, yes. Yeah, she handles that nicely. Good save. Victory at Inverness. And wants to desperately get back on that team again. That was the third shot of Boudier. And nicely done. Stays just below the hole. It's a very accessible hole. Third. She went after this one. This should have some spin on it. Oh. oh. Yeah, nice. Three good shots in there. Excellent. A long chance. It's going to break quite quickly left. Yep. There's the break. There's the read. Good. Stays at 1,400. Nice save. All right, so cool for birdie at nine. On the same line. There you go. Left the last one short, but she got that one in there with plenty of speed. Oh, if it goes, this could be really good. Really swung those arms nicely to the left. Excellent shot once again. 
Hit a good one back at nine. Didn't have to putt because her partner made it, but one of the best we've seen. Uh, and after a little bit of a sluggish start, you can see this this group, this pairing, really starting to to hit some quality shots and kind of get their feet wet in this format. She would be uh, a little short of this whole location. She had an 83 yards, and that was beautifully played. Yeah, well done. Didn't let that bad break get to her. She had an excellent shot in there. Smart play. They shoot a 60. Hole in one. They shoot a 59. There you go. I love the way you're thinking. They well. Both. It's a week of opportunities. It's a great week for them if they can finish it off at least with a birdie. Well, Sarah's been playing fairly solidly this year, but Elena, status on the Epson Tour. And That'll work. If you're Matilda Castro and you know you're obviously a winner on the on the LPGA tour already, but you want it for your for your friend, you know, one of your best friends out here, Kelly Tan, you want her to also be a winner on the tour. And, mm -hmm. You know, it's it's there's a lot of emotions involved in this for each other, like you want it so much for the other person. And we head up now to the 18th. It is a par three finishing hole. This green surrounded by water, and this team of Sarah Kemp and Elena Sharp were lighting up the golf course today. <laughs> Count it. A sign of today's times, Karen. And <laughs> she just hits it down the middle of the fairway. She hits greens all the time. My goodness. Wouldn't it be nice to play golf like that? Yes, it would. Here's another one. And not only that trip, she's actually kind of good with the putter as well. She's a very solid player across the board tough to throw this one up in the air but she's got her partner in there pretty close so look for her to be aggressive with this one oh yeah that looks good mm -hmm. hey Maria Fossey now for birdies and Stacy Lewis 16 under this to get to 17 and Stacy's helping her look at this putt and read it well, they both read it right, yes, and that was just a moment ago. Going to be a great finish here up at the 18th. This is Megan Kang partnering with Allison Lee. This for Birdie. Just a fascinating home hole, Karen. It is with the par three. I mean, you're playing down over the water. You've got a great setting with the clubhouse on the right, big stands round behind it. And, and they play in it where the whole location is accessible for that kind of excitement today. That's okay. That's not pretty. So the Borga now here at 13. Back or need to get something going here, a little draw here, nice high, 95 feet on the apex, going right at it. Excellent shot. Top of the leaderboard, proven winners. Up at the 18th, this is Pei Yun Chen, partnering with Yu Sang Ho. <laughs> Finally, we see one friendly curl in. Pei Yun Chen's nickname is Money. That part was Money. Holly Mack now for Birdie. Maybe we talk a lot about how far she hits her tee shots, but. She's been rolling the ball pretty well today. Oh, I'd say that's after the delay, Karen. How about that? We're just now for birdie. All right, gets them to 18 under par. So things are tightening up here. Good way to start out. They weren't, uh, weather delay didn't stop them any. Especially if there's, as you were saying, very little break. Just keep it inside the hole and, and make sure you hit the back of the hole. She does just that. Nice. Oh, Maybe get something going for them. So good birdie at the par 3, 13. They moved to 20, just one back. There's 115. This is the kind of shot you want to come back to out of a rain delay. You're looking right at the whole location. That looks oh, good. Yeah, it does. Beautiful shot. They're on a pretty good roll today. They had it going yesterday, let it get away, but they're still not out of it. Yeah, she's got 108 left. Okay, it's for Birdie. She's with Lindbergh this week. A nice finish here last year. Different partner, but same result. Nice putt. So they finished with 68. <laughs> they were excited to get her done. 
Oh, she is in the middle. There's no worries. Polly headed all the way. That gets them a little closer to that lead. Here. It's just a moment ago. Trying to get it to turn. Don't have to turn much. Is this any good? Did she? Yes, she did. Thank you, Golf Did she hit it? That is clutch right there. Big time. Fist pumps all around. Beautiful putt. Clutch putt. So tough to follow a putt and top it. She does. Wow. <laughs> Any questions? <laughs> she almost looked like she took a little breath there, too. Just a. Whew. Such a great putt. And we finish at 22 under. Cheyenne Knight gets her second LPGA win. Elizabeth Sokol, her first, and they are your champions.